Hey guys, it's Michaela, and today I'm going to walk you through a few tricks for when your YouTube sound is not working on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and simple, so let's jump in. So the first thing, if I'm planning to play a video on YouTube and it's not the sound is not working, um, we want to make sure an obvious one is that your volume is up. So on the side of your phone, you can you know change the volume up and down. And to do that, you just click the up button and then the down button. Now, if I'm playing it and, you know, my sound is all the way up and I'm still not hearing anything, the first thing I want to check after that is to go to our settings and then go to Bluetooth and to make sure that nothing's connected. So say like you had it connected to your AirPods um, and then you forgot and now you're trying to play it this way. Um, if it's still connected to your AirPods or connected to your car or something, it's not going to play through your phone. It's going to go through what it's connected to. So if it's connected, if you can see something on there that's connected, you can turn it off or, you know, you can click them all off by just turning off your Bluetooth like that and all of them will automatically turn off. So if the Bluetooth is not connected and your volume is up, we can go back to the YouTube and there is a chance that the mute is on on your YouTube. Now, if it's on, it will be indicated by, you know, a megaphone with an X through it in the corner. And all you have to do is click on that on your video and then it will toggle it on and off. But if you're having the newest YouTube um update then you know that that option is not going to be on there so if you have a previous update um, then if that will maybe be the case so the next thing we want to try is to make sure that we do have the most up-to-date version of YouTube so to do that we're gonna go out of that we're gonna go to our App Store hit the open we're gonna search for YouTube and then right where mine says open, if yours says update, you want to make sure to update that. Sometimes if there's a glitch in the system where if you don't have it fully updated, then you know it's not going to work to its uh, highest capacity. So you want to make sure that's fully updated. Now, if that's already updated and all your settings are proper um, and you know it's going the right way, um, what you want to do is kind of just reset the app. So to do that, all we do is go to settings, and then we're going to go to general iPhone storage. Then we're going to find our YouTube. Here it is. And we're going to offload the app. Offloading the app doesn't do anything to your personal information on the app, but it does reset the app. So if there is some kind of glitch, it's a back end of YouTube problem. You know, there is a setting that got messed up along the way that you can't just reset on your own like we did. Then all you have to do is offload it. It's like deleting the app and then reinstalling it from um, the app store. So it does nothing to your end, but it does reset the app so that all the settings can go back to normal. So once it's reinstalled, then you'll be good to go and you can go ahead and adjust the volume on the side of your phone and go about it that way. If you guys have any questions on that, let us know in the comments below. If not, don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe.